easy for you now You got two minutes of my time And I don't really break too easily But I'm worth it Cause I'll slip into your dreams tonight Good morning everybody So I just did my hair with the air wrap Been a while since I've done it But it's like every time the result is so good It's just so voluminous and it's just does it take less time? No, it takes maybe even more time than if you were to just like blow dry hair and then curl it. But the result is just so fantastical, it's hard to argue against it. And I just have to say, I love the volume. And I love the effect and the look. So I saw a video on Instagram and I was like, I gotta do this. You know what I mean? So anyway, I'm gonna go do my makeup over. I've been doing it over in this corner over here. I'm about to try out, I just ordered this off of Amazon this huge puff and I'm like hoping that it will help with my under eye area so I'm gonna use it with the Huda Beauty powder I need to buy the fragrance free version because I heard that that's the best but I'm gonna take a good amount this is like a nice big velour puff I got it for like six bucks on Amazon oh yeah oh yeah this is good I can tell all right, I'm gonna do my contour. I've been loving this. This is the Catrice. I also got this on Amazon. So, I wanna go for a very bronzy look today. Still been loving this Too Faced bronzer, the natural chocolate one. So good. Here we go. I'm gonna do the buttermilk blush today. This is called Butter Together. It's a pretty shade. Okay, makeup is done. Hair is done. I'm gonna brush it out. Uh-oh. My bangs get kind of messed up. Look at this crazy volume. Oh my god. I'm obsessed. All right, so I just brushed it out really quickly. But my bangs are getting super long. I mean, they used to be literally like proper bangs almost where they were right here. But now they're kind of really super extra long. I mean, look at that. I just love the look. There's nothing like the Dyson Airwrap, and I hate to say that, I really do. All right, everybody. Well, as you can see, I'm at Hobby Lobby. I just jump on trends like crazy, and I honestly kind of love it. There's something to me that it's this similar itch that it scratches when I start a new hobby and then like I buy all the stuff for the hobby because honestly that's a hobby in itself is like collecting things for your new hobby. I kind of feel that way about different aesthetics. Like I love to jump on different aesthetics that and like just change and be like, okay, am I goth this week? Yes, no. <laughs> am I coastal grandma this week? Yes, strawberry girl makeup trend. Like I love stuff like that. I love collecting things, the thrill of the hunt, whatever. Okay, you get the point. So anyway, I have recently joined in on the charm necklace trend. Okay, I bought this one off of Amazon and these are just, it was like $14 or something, but you can kind of clasp these on and take them off. So I was like, okay, well that just gives me like a base, right? Cause these are like not my favorite. I mean, some of these are kind of weird. Like some of them are like moon stuff, but I was like, well, maybe I should try to go in there and you know, like I want to get like a K one and just see what they've got, honestly. Okay. And then I also want to look at some of the 4th of July things as well. So I'm going to look at that and just see if they have any cute stuff that's not just for 4th of July, but can be versatile, you know, for many seasons. So that's where I'm doing. Cool. Heading inside. Meet you in there. So give me, so give me your all. I'll take it, I'll take it to Mars. Oh, I'll stick like glue inside. So I'm here and of course they changed the whole store layout. <laughs> I came right back here. I'm like, where is it? I don't know why they do this. I just watch me break it.
definitely call that moderately unsuccessful. I did find a couple things, but honestly, sadly, nothing really better than what I have already on this freaking thing. I am going to head over to Target really quick. I gotta pick up a couple of things. Does anyone else sell charms? I mean, they're kind of hard to find, and I went on Amazon as well, like, while I was in there, and I was looking, and it didn't really look like they had any either. I mean, they have charms, but they're not cute. And I definitely wasn't the first person to get to that charm section, I'll tell you that. Other people beat me there. Alright guys, well, I'm back from the stores and things like that, and I have a little bit of a haul for you. So, I had an idea on the way home, and as I was walking out of that store, I was like, you know... It might be kind of a fun idea if we did like a charm necklace making party kind of thing. And I don't know if that's like a thing or not, but I was in there and I'm like, you know, maybe I'll just get like a couple extras because there's a lot of these, for example, like this one, right? They have a lot of charms on, they have like six charms and I don't need all six, I would only need one. So I did get a couple extra necklaces and I figured maybe when my mom comes we could do some bracelets or something like that. So anyway, I'm just going to show you guys what I got. And like I said, not the greatest charms. I'm going to have to look and see online on Amazon or something. But I did find this and then I figured I could always take them off because they're just simple jump rings. But this was only uh, $3.99 and then it was 50% off. So it was $2. So I was like, ooh. But yeah, it has like all these little hearts and things and blah, blah, blah. So I thought that was super cute. So you definitely need like these kind of paper clippy style ones like this so you can attach them on there but i already have jewelry making little pliers so that's nice and then i did get this because i thought okay so cute like this is definitely so cute so this one's kind of got the same thing going on like i said i think this one's probably the cutest unfortunately i also did get this one as well so this is just a little extra one so you know to make ones and like make more and blah 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 so a lot of these were 50 percent off but i got these this little daisies that's cute i think i already showed you this but they're little ladybugs and i thought that was very cute i'm gonna say cute a lot in this cute <laughs> so just little hearts with rhinestones that are different colors i did find this i was really liking the fairy tale line and the hello happy line but this is cute. So the red hearts, love that. I just love this red color right now. I'm very into it. Then I found this, this was on sale. I don't think I would've got this unless it was on sale, but it's these little flowers, but it was 137 down from 549, which is, I think is pretty good. So I tried to do some, you know, clearance ones as well. These, this is gorgeous. Okay, this is absolutely gorgeous. Like this is probably my favorite set of charms that I picked up. So yeah, I just, I thought that was really, they're imitation opal charms, so got that. And then these last ones I did get all on clearance. So these little moons were really cute. This was 99 cents down from $4. So I liked that. And then finally, I don't know, I think these are kind of fun and cute and I'm into like strawberry stuff right now, but this was $8.99 down to $2.24 for these and they're kind of exactly what I'm looking for. Kind of like that whimsical, weird, you know, when you look up like chunky charm necklace trend, it's a lot of, you know, like gold and big, like, but they're bigger than this even. Like they're, they're big charms and it's a lot of just all gold. I mean, sometimes you have like other things, but it would also be cute to make this into a bracelet too. You could do a charm bracelet, but I got two of them cause I was like, that would be fun for my little charm making party, you know, charm bracelet party. So there you go. That's my haul. I'm going to look on Amazon and just see. I'm sure that they have other charms that I can pick up that are cute. Like I'm, the ones I look up, when you look up gold charms on Amazon, yuck. Okay, not cute, ugly, gross. They're just basic and they're tiny and they're not cool enough. So I'm going to do some Pinteresting. I have been crazy obsessed with Pinterest recently. Just back on it every day i'm on pinterest looking up things pinning things loving the style inspiration pinning you know phone backgrounds and i'm like everything about it i'm like i'm obsessed i'm spending a considerable amount of time on there so 
I'm gonna look on there and just try to pin some chunky charm necklaces that I really like. Like I would love to get one that has like a cherry on it or something and blah, 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 you get the picture. I don't think, for example, I could get these on Amazon and I don't think I could get them for as affordable as what I did, but oh, it's the tiny little chair. Guys, that's it for today's video. I am going to, oh my God, what is wrong with you? I snuck my water bottle over. I am going to go edit this video and try to get some R&R. &R. Tomorrow we have the pool people coming to hopefully get our pool to a clean state. So I will be observing and I will be filming it. And I will be giving you updates on the pool. And hopefully they can get it done in one day. And I will also hopefully have them explain to me what is going on with the pool so we know what's going on. So anyway, hope you guys have enjoyed this video and I will see you tomorrow.